I'm Jake from Modern Baseball. And I'm Brendan from the same band, and you're watching Ampy. Hey everyone, it's Alicia from Ambi, and I would like to welcome you to our interview with Modern Baseball. Hello. 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 Hi. <laughs> Hi. How are you both doing? We're great. Good. You just played an Good awesome set here at Turf, so walk me through your day. How is Turf going so far? It's going great. Um, we came up here today, and it, it's been wonderful so far. Everyone's been really helpful and nice. Yeah. Um, something I guess we're not used to do in the States. <laughs> must be a Canadian thing. Yeah, it must be Canadian We're known thing. for being overly polite, yeah. so maybe. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> You're playing a lot of festivals this summer, everything from Reading to Turf today. So what have been some of your summer highlights? Reading and Leeds was cool. Reading and Leeds, yeah, that was cool. Um, turf is sick. Um, I can't believe drive-by truckers are like playing. Yeah, that's, that's crazy. That they're like near us. Jason <laughs> Isbell's is gonna be up yeah. there. <laughs> you guys gonna wait around? Do you have time? Are you driving back to Philly? I think we need to start heading back, uh, but yeah. which kind of stinks. But we all have so many things to do. Like, <laughs> so. Well, it's been a very exciting time for you guys. Cause you're soon hitting the road with some of your biggest influences, brand yeah. new. Yeah. What was yeah. it like when you either got the call or you were notified? This is actually happening. It's confirmed. Let's do this. It was funny because like these those kind of things they happen super far in advance but they happen super fast so it was kind of like oh do you want to go on tour with brand new you have like the weekend to talk it over and we were like yes <laughs> i think we figured it out yeah like, as soon can... as that messenger pigeon flew in the window doesn't matter when yes. doesn't matter where yes yeah when jesse lacy dropped through our chimney <laughs> we were like yeah sure <laughs> we wrote yes on his chest in a big black sharpie <laughs> <laughs> yeah but it was that's kind of a, just a crazy thing in general. Like the concept of that to us is insane. So, well, congratulations! Yeah. Thanks. Thank You're you. welcome. Thank you. If you yeah. could hit the road with any one of your other big influences, which would you love to eventually do one day? I think the only one we have left is Dashboard Confessional. That's oh, right. Okay. Yeah. Like yeah. on our listed influences yeah. on our Facebook page, we've t either toured or played a lot of shows with yeah. the influences. Uh, Motion City just broke up. Rest um, in peace. I don't know. Yeah. Dashboard conventional. I would love to do a Metallica tour. <laughs> Who uh, knows, man? Weaker Thans. Weaker Thans. Yeah. Cool. yeah. <laughs> You're both like, yeah, that'd be pretty <laughs> rad. Like, yeah. <laughs> I couldn't help but notice the Austin Powered Austin Powers inspired uh, yeah. turret poster that you guys have. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you guys big fans? <laughs> Thank you very much. You guys big fans of the films? Um, it's funny because the one of the first times we went over there for like real, um, where we were playing more than like 10 shows was with our friends in Sprainerd. Okay. And uh, we watched every, all three movies like four times. Definitely a few times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So it, was so it just made sense. Yeah. We're going back. Let's put yeah. this together. Yeah. Now when we hang out with them, we all like quote yes. moments that totally aren't quotable. <laughs> and then when we say it to other people, they're like, yeah. it goes right over their about? head. Yeah. 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 I do that with family members with Van Halen songs. Oh, Whoa. So sometimes we'll just be like, I got my pencil and no one has any <laughs> idea. They have no idea what we're talking about, that but we, awesome. we think it's fantastic. Yeah. Whoa, that's so... <laughs> Such a oh deep God, joke. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like the Austin Powers thing, though. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> toy. Toy like a tiger. Yeah. <laughs> Space was cool. Yeah. <laughs> Which other films do you guys collectively really enjoy? We had a big Borat kick this okay. summer. Borat. Um, it holds up. Yeah. Offensive wise. Offensive um. wise. It's <laughs> still family friendly. <laughs> um, aggressive family friend friendly. Yeah. Borat. It's um, almost famous. Almost famous. Classic. Is a big, like tour watch thing for us. Um, we also pretty much binge Harry Potter, yep. like all of them, whenever we can. Yep. Um, so maybe do that in the next few days when we're home. Yeah. Okay. Like a few days we have off. Yeah. And then individually, personally, you know, what is the ultimate movie or the best film ever made? Jurassic Park. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Yeah. He's already well, repping it. Jurassic World, but yeah. Same thing. Good job. <laughs> I like uh, books. <laughs> I like books. I like the word Your version. Favorite movie? Um, Judge and Redemption. Shawshank Redemption. That's mine. Monsters, Inc. Monsters, Inc. Annie Hall. Yeah. Annie Hall, yeah. yeah. All right. Well, I have to say congr congrats on the release of Holy Ghost. Thanks. Thanks You're so very much. welcome. What do you feel is one of the coolest things to happen since you've unleashed this new record with all your fans? Honestly, that people like it a lot. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's so sick um, that they like it. We did a lot of weirder things on this record, so the fact that our fans, like, 
crowded around us and backed us really hard, especially around like times of trouble. Yeah. <laughs> um, was really sweet. But also, I think just the fact that we're going on tour with Brand New is pretty insane. <laughs> yep. That was pretty crazy. Indeed. <laughs> like, Indeed. So. Um, we're on Australia radio a lot, which is weird. Yeah. Like, we'll go to Australia and hear us on the, like, just in the car yeah. while we're driving. And that was, like, big, like, uh, Yeah, what's that? <laughs> Do you guys all geek out in the car? Like, yeah. it's us! Yeah, it was crazy. That and, like, we sound like that? Ew. Yeah. <laughs> it's also cool because a lot of people will come up to me now and be like, Hey, dude, I'm going to be really real. I didn't really like your band before, but I listened to this new record and it's like my favorite record ever. And I'm like, that's awesome. That's awesome. I totally the... won you. Aww. So. <laughs> we have a lot of those fans now. <laughs> yeah. you Play the new stuff. <laughs> you mentioned a bit about how a lot of this record has to do with times of trouble, but what I think is awesome is you guys actually have a safe space hotline that fans can call. Wow. And that's, that's just absolutely amazing because a lot of people can call and actually discuss some of the things you discussed on this record. So whose idea was it to create that? It was a group effort. Um, a really big shout out to the people involved, like our tour manager Overholt, who runs the hotline. Our publicist Talia, who came up with the idea of just like making it something you can contact every single day. Yeah. Um, something that's super easy to use. Like um, Talia and our manager Eric, along with the rest of us, just like really just piled in and tried to make it work as this it's could. a great idea so far so good yeah like we have some people call in who are just like does this thing work is this thing on like, <laughs> yes <laughs> like not that many prank calls though yeah You're okay the first the, day yeah first, first day was pretty rough yeah. all right that. yeah i think once people realize that we are taking it very seriously of course they're like oh we can't call in and prank them anymore. <laughs> like, uh, is your fridge riding? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> You're at a music venue. <laughs> uh, one, yeah. one thing I came across was your Facebook description. And it, you have to tell me the, the meaning behind this. Because it's literally just wow. all capital letters. And it's, what the Quan? So, oh, what is wow. that? What the Quan was like the... Er Sean Kingston. Yeah, Sean Kingston. Uh, what the Quan. Early, deep inside joke for us yeah. okay like I, deep I forgot about that like got it back when back when we checked facebook new. every day yeah yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, what the clown what the clown okay so yeah I think our influences at the time were also like regional rail and Christmas cookies. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> it's on there. Yeah. Still? Yeah, I know it's it's uh, cookies, cats, and Christmas lights. Yeah. Oh, wow, <laughs> cool. Keeping it up to date. Yeah, those rocks. things are still cool. Yeah, those things are still cool. <laughs> <laughs> Let's wrap things up today. Is there anything you want to say to all of your fans who'll be viewing? Thanks for watching. Thank you very yeah. much. Thank you for interviewing. Thank us. you so much for sitting down with us. Yeah, no it's been an absolute pleasure. Oh, same. <laughs> That's good to know. <laughs> and remember to everybody viewing, you can visit us at musicblogger.com for all exclusive interviews, features, videos, and so much more with your favorite bands. See you next time. Bye. Bye.